Yo, what is going on today, guys? So, today's video, man, we're going to be doing a gameplay for Diamond Jeff Malone. I happened to get this guy out of the vault, and I didn't really see, like, too much about him on YouTube, so I decided to bring a gameplay of him myself. I was lucky to get him out the vault, man, and uh, this card, from what I used it already, first off, the man's got a bad, that man need a shape up ASAP. Look at that, bro. Oh! Ew, bro. Man, bro, get a shape up, big man. But... I mean, he seems like a T-Mac kind of player, just to tell you right off the bat. He's a 6'4", shooting guard, small forward. Definitely wouldn't play him at the small forward. He's got 94 offense, 88 defense. Let's take a look at his attributes and badges. He's got a 94 driving layup. He's got a 94 mid-range and 82 three, a 92 free throw, 85 driving dunk. And his perimeter defense is 82. And uh, his speed of balls, 86, speed 88. Acceleration, 88, vertical, 92. It seems what he, he's going to excel at would be like his dunking with the 85 driving dunk with the high vertical you know so um yeah let's take a look at his badges though as well he's got five hall of fame badges and he's got 25 gold the hall of fame ones are pro touch slithery finisher green machine hot zone hunter and tile shooter the gold ones difficult shots fearless finisher acrobat teardropper heat seeker break starter lob city finisher highlight film posterizer tireless defender trapper anti-freeze what does that do? I don't even know what that does. Harder to get cold and lose your takeover. Okay. Hot shot. Boost takeover after hitting jump shots. Okay. Giant slayer. Rhythm shooter. Downhill. Quick first step. Space creator. Unpluckable. Stop and pop. Ice and veins. Bullet passer. Special delivery. Ankle braces. Volume shooter. And then on silver, he's got chase down artist clamps and off ball pests. So it's good that he has clamps. The clamps cannot be upgraded. His upgradable badges though here are catch and shoot corner specialist post spin technician drop stepper put back boss ankle breaker dimer hook specialist back down pu uh, punisher rise up what is that makes it easier to dunk when under the basket okay blinders circus threes fade ace deep threes he can get deep threes hit this card with deep threes would, would be effective if you had like a three-point shoe on him and with the coach right he's, he's also got you could put bail out on him Put Dream Shake, Handles for Days, Needle Threader, Set Shooter, Stop and Go, Tight Handles, Clutch Shooter, Dead Eye, Sniper, Slippery All Bone, Floor General. If you happen to actually like put these badges on him, this card would be amazing. It would be really amazing. Um, With the stuff that he has already, he's a, he's a solid card from what I've used him already. So we're going to get into some gameplay. I'm probably going to go in Triple Threat Online because I don't really play anything else. So um, yeah, we'll just do it through there. And we'll see what he's like. Before we do that, I do wanted to come here into the shoot around just to show you his hot zones and uh, his release. So he's got hot zones everywhere besides like this top area around the three point. So, you know, this obviously the top of the key here and then like the left side and the right side. And then in the paint, the left and the right two are just neutral. Everywhere else is hot. And he does have the, the that Tracy release. He does have, you can see it right there. You can see that Tracy release. It feels a little bit slow, not gonna lie. So you just gotta, you gotta like just get used to it if you happen to get this card. But you can see that, you can see that Tracy release in there. This is an amazing release, one of the best absolutely in the game. And it, it, it was last year too. I mean, we all love this release. It's so easy to green with. I wish it was faster on him though. I don't know if that's how it feels on Tracy too. I've never used Tracy, but this is definitely how it feels on Jeff Malone. And um, if you know his release, he'll be hitting shots with that 82 three ball. You put a shoe on him, he'll be very effective. All right, bro. So my opponent is using Pink Diamond Tracy, Pink Diamond MJ, and he also has an Andre Iguodala. I'm assuming that's the Ruby one. I don't know of any other Iguodala. Oh, man. Oh, man. I'm over here getting cooked. First possession. TTO has been very sweaty, man. I'm not going to lie. I mean, every mode has been sweaty for me, at least. But let's see what Jeff Malone's about, man. Let's see what he can do. I'll hit him with the... Ooh, nice behind the back, Jeff. Throw it down on him. Hey, Jeff Malone. Bro, good stuff. Excuse me. All right, now play some defense. We need that. We need that. Oh, wait, what? is that the Pink Diamond Iguodala? Is there a Pink Diamond Iguodala in this game that I just don't know about? How am I getting matched up with a guy like this? That MJ cannot shoot. I mean, if you know his release, you can green with him. But I'm going to sag off a little bit on that man. Man, he's just going to blow right past me. I've got Fat Lever for defense, and he's just not doing anything. It's okay, though. It's okay. We're not going to give up. We're going to try to fight back in this game. Oh, this man, Jeff Malone, you can't guard me. You can't guard me. No. Nope. Oh, you're blowing layups? That's tough. That's tough. What is this guy doing, bro? Come on, man. There we go. Yeah, come come, come play, bro. I'm, I'm there. Yeah, okay. Funny man. Good rebound, fat. Send it to Jeff. 
Jeff. Oh, I want to light it up right now, bro. No, it's not a good shot. That's not a good shot. Oh, yeah. This is it right here. There it is, Jeff. There it is, Jeff. That T-Mac release is absolutely bananas, bro. That's what I need right there. Come on. Let's keep it up. Let's keep it up, bro. If he leaves me open enough, I'm just going to light him up the whole game. That is definitely off. Good rebound, Jeff. Jeff, 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 Jeff. He's leaving me. Oh, that was a bad shot. That was a terrible shot. Do not. Okay. Do not base this gameplay upon shots like that. He's. That was a terrible shot. We're going to take it to the rim, though. Throw it down. Let's go. That puts us up 7-4. Took one bad shot. It's okay. It's okay. We got to play some great defense right here, man. We've been doing a decent job already. Oh, crap. I got to guard him. That's off. That's off. Let's go. Let's go. Bad shot, big man. My type of steal. Oh, yeah. Snatch back. Oh, yeah, right past Iguodala. Man, he's, he's locked. He's playing off ball, bro. Like, you know, and he's got Iguodala. That's a great defender. I don't even know what card that is. I thought there was only a Ruby Iguodala. I'm going to call for a screen though because he's off balling me. So, yeah, I'm going to do that. <sighs> Couldn't get the layup off. It wasn't a good layup. Didn't get the kind of shot I would have liked. It's okay, though. We're not expecting him. He's not taking that many smart shots either. So, oh, he snapped me, bro. Okay, is he going to get that? Come on, block that. Ah, man, big man can't guard up. Come on, Sabonis. You're too big. This man is, what, 7-1 or something? I don't know. I don't know. Can't respect... Oh, stupid behind the back. Oof. Oh, can't guard it. Mid-range. Oof. Ah, 52% covered. I got to take better shots than that. I felt like I had more of an opening. And he greens it, and now I'm losing. All right, come on. Tighten up. Tighten up, Nick. You got this, bro. You got this. You're not taking the smarter shots. So you got to step up. You got to step it up. Come on, bro. Oh, yeah, right past Iguodala. No, I didn't. I wanted a pump fake. I wanted a pump fake, and it forced me into a, a layup, bro. Oh, my gosh. Let's go. Good, good rebound. I don't know if he knows I'm going nut with Jeff Malone on purpose. Oh, he's leaving me open. No, don't fade. He greens it anyways. Jeff Malone, good stuff, man. I'm starting to like this card more. I didn't really use him that much before. Ah, this dude, Sabonis, cannot guard Tracy. That's the thing. Sabonis is just too slow for Tracy, man. Yep. He's just too slow. Good help. And it just it wasn't enough. Man, that's tough. All right, Jeff. I need you to put the team on your back right now and go crazy. If we can get a slight opening, it's a green. That's what we're looking for. We're looking to get a slight. Okay, he's reaching. Don't do that. Don't do that, big fella. Don't do that. Come on. How are you pass me the ball so I can drop you off? All right. Come on. Get the ball fat. I want to take that. But, you know, this is a gameplay, so, yeah, we're not going to do that. All right, you know what? I, oh, come on. Good cut. Send it back to Jeff for the mid-range. Green, thank you. Thank you. You see, I was going to take the layup with Fat Lever, but, you know, he kind of left Jeff open, so I had to take advantage of the moment. He's just going to cook me with Tracy the entire game. I don't want to let him get a three. I'd rather let him get a two. So we're going to just, like, try to stay up. But you see, you see how I just can't stay in front? It's just hard, especially since I don't off ball. It's just very hard. No, he got me. He got me. He got me. Ah, oh, bruh. Like, what am I supposed to do? This guy cannot play any defense. And my man's is not using a big man or my opponent, I should say. Oh, all right. You see, and he's off balling and stuff like this is pathetic. This is pathetic, bro. Come set me a screen now. Come set me a screen. You want to off ball, right? I don't call for screens unless I get, I'm getting. Oh, he's reaching. He's reaching. Throw the, throw the lob up. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I had to throw that lob up. That gives me my takeover. I don't want to go completely nut with Jeff because I might lose this game if I do. So, yeah. Oh, great. He got past me. But Jeff has got that takeover. Maybe this maybe this is the, the, the difference maker in the game. Can I just go? Can I just rim run and just dunk on him? Hey, we just did it right there. You better guard up. You better guard that man, bro. That man got takeover, bro. If he had sharp takeover, I would really be pulling from half. Easy. Oh, snap. Hold on. No, he's got to take over. Ah, oh, he's making fading greens, bro. This is a problem, man. I I would love to hit a three right here to retaliate, but... Oh, come on, Jeff. Jeff with the three! The clutch three. Okay, no threes. No threes. Guard up on Tracy. You know he's got takeover. He wants to shoot it. No! That's off. Let's go. Let's go. Yo, this dude, this dude's a bonus is just so slow. You know what I want to do? I want to abuse 
Oh, GG, GG, let's go, let's go, W, man, against the sweat who missed the wide open three with Tracy to win the game, you're tight, bro, you're tight. All right, Jeff Malone had 19, he shot eight for 13 from the field, I took a couple bad shots with him, man, my man's hairline is even messed up, even in the fake picture, bro, they do my, my guy dirty, bro, come on, 2K, give him a shape up. All right, so I loaded up into another game, I wanted to give you guys multiple games of TTO while using Jeff Malone, he's leaving me open. That's a green, bro. His release is so smooth, man. His release is so smooth. He only has an 82-3, but it's like, it doesn't matter because his release is just so good. So, yeah, I wanted to give you guys multiple gameplays here on TTO because I kind of made a decision to not play Unlimited again. If you guys, you know, watched my videos last year, you saw me, like, not really playing Unlimited um, like that. And it was because I didn't enjoy the mode as we get a dunk right there with Jeff. It, I didn't enjoy the mode, so... I thought it was too sweaty and toxic and people always running five out and off balling and all that. And it's just, it makes it for like, it doesn't make the experience of playing unlimited fun. When I'm playing unlimited, I should have fun. I shouldn't be getting upset because some dude is using some gimmick to win, right? So the same thing happened. I was playing, it wasn't even on, actually it was on unlimited. It was on limited too though, on both modes. Mid range, oof, off. Jeff Malone, all right, we're gonna try it again. But I was playing limited the other day and it, was just, it just wasn't fun because my opponent was just straight up cheesing and playing toxic. So I kind of just decided not to play that. All my gameplays from this for this year are going to be on TTO. So that's why, you know, I'm bringing you multiple games. So, you know, you have multiple games so you can see, you know, the value of the card as I, you know, I took a bad shot there. I got locked up. I'm not going to lie. But this guy doesn't seem to be as sweaty as the last one. So uh, we'll see. We'll see, man. We'll see. Good defense right here by Fat Lever. Give it to Jeff. I'm going to pull the three. Oh, that was early. I released that one early. Yep. If you don't release it green. Oh, bad pass. If you don't release it green, good chances it's going to miss because he only, like I said, he does have the 82-3. It's not great. I mean, it's solid. It's not great, though. So you, you kind of have to green it, but it isn't hard to green it. So don't even worry about that. Just make sure you got to green those shots. Oh, good, good defense. If you get this card, practice is releasing the freestyle. You know, it takes up, or I don't know, I don't know how long it takes on current gen to load. I mean, but on, on next gen, bro, it loads up real fast. Um, you know, loading it, loading it to freestyle. Oh, good dunk. Yeah, practice is, practice is releasing freestyle, man. That Tracy release, he has the same release. I'm pretty sure Damar, this Damar that I'm going up against has that same release as well. And uh, Tracy obviously has it. There's a couple cards in 2K20 that had it. Like, uh, I forgot this. I think Walter Davis was one. There's, there's, there's been quite a few who had that release. Oh, he's jumping. Fat Lever's open. I could, nah, we're not going to pull that. Jeff is opening. Ooh, bad pass, bro. Why am I making these bad passes? I got to, I got to tighten up, man. I'm, I got, I'm selling right now. All right, let's play some defense, though. Ooh, no way. Huh? Excuse me? All right, bro. It's time to, it's time to destroy this, man. Time to destroy. I'm not. I'm not putting up with this no more, bro. Oh yeah. Ah, I was just about to take it up and he fouled me. I was just about to go up for the dunk and he reached. And they called it, man. What a lucky guy. Give it back to Jeff. Jeff, man. Imagine him playing for the Knicks. Oh, take that. Oh, good dunk, Jeff. Let's go over Surge. That's the thing, man. He can shoot. He can dunk, bro, and he can play defense. So that's that makes this a good card already. No way. If he would have made, I would have been pretty upset. Dunk it over Surge. You see that? Oh my gosh. Bro, he's got the takeover. He's got the takeover, bro. Yo, this man is ridiculous, man. I should use him more. When I got him, I really wasn't using him like that. This card is actually a beast. Hold on. Do it again. Oh my gosh. Yo, this card is crazy, man. Oh, let me get the steal right here. Oh, man. I couldn't get it. Bro, this, he's just dunking on everyone. Oh, give me that. Let's go. All the way, Jeff. All the way, Jeff. Let's go, bro. He's got that gold downhill that makes for the fast breaks. You know, this, yo, this stuff is lit. This card is lit. I'm really enjoying using this card, man. This actually became like my favorite card after this gameplay. And I never used them before that. I mean, I used them in a game, but barely. Like, I didn't know what he was like until I started making this video. I didn't know he was that effective. Look at this. Look at the green. Yo. Woo. This is my favorite card in the game, bro. This is my favorite card in the game. Okay. Man, this guy's nice. 
Yo, you guys need to be on that triple threat. I got him because I was uh, doing some challenges and I just, you know, was playing triple threat, grinding out some XP challenges. I won the game and they gave me Jeff Malone. And I'm very grateful for it. This card is fun to use. He can dunk, he can shoot, he can play defense. Like he, he's got one of the best releases in the game. It's, it's just amazing. It's just amazing. I wish he had deep threes. That would make this card, oof, bro. It would make this card just bananas. Let's see, let's see this dunk. Look at the dunking. Oh my gosh. And you know, I'm gonna talk about, I'm gonna even say this card might be better than the Pink Diamond Tracy. And the only reason I would say that is because he has clamps. This card has silver clamps. Not gold, you know, but I'm taking the silver clamps over no clamps. Tracy, he has no clamps and he can't, he, you can't even apply clamps to him at all. Man, what's up with this camera angle? You can't even apply clamps to him at all. You know, that's, that's game right there. You can't apply clamps to Tracy at all. This card comes with clamps and you can put deep threes on him and, and a whole bunch of other badges. This card, if I were to badge him out com completely, he would be a monster. If I put a three point shoe on him and I, and I had a good coach that boosted the three ball for him, he would be a monster. He already is a monster. Let's take a look at the box score. 10 for 13, all 22 points, you know. I lit it up that game. I was mostly just dunking on him, though, for the most part. We're going to compare him to Pink Diamond Tracy right now before we end off the video. All right, so here we got. We got Pink Diamond Tracy on the left, Jeff Malone on the right. So Jeff Malone's got a higher driving layup. The three ball Tracy's got it. He's got a 93 ball. That's great for him. Jeff does have a higher mid-range, though. He does have a lesser driving dunk. Um, The lesser ball handle by just one. The defense, though, is better on Jeff's side. I mean, the block, Tracy has higher, but... Jeff has a higher steal. The perimeter defense is the same, but keep in mind the clamps. The offensive rebound, Tracy's got it. The speed, Jeff's got it. I would say, I would say the athleticism in general. I just had a hiccup, sorry. The athleticism in general, Jeff has got it. Um, the thing is, Tracy is 6'8, so he has that going for him. You can play Tracy at the two or the three. Jeff, he has to be played at the two. He's too small for the three. So, I mean, you could still make the argument that Tracy's better because of the height and because of he has a little bit of better attributes, maybe. Um, but Look at the badges here. Jeff has more gold badges. He has one less Hall of Fame, although Tracy does have three more in silver and one on bronze. Jeff does have the clamps, and that makes for a big factor here. The fact that Jeff has clamps and uh, Tracy does have deep threes. Jeff doesn't. But you can apply deep threes to Jeff. You cannot apply clamps to Tracy. Does Jeff have quick first step? I don't remember if he does. He does have quick first step on gold. Tracy has it on silver. So really, you guys can make the... You know the judgment i don't know what what car do you think is better let me know in the comments what car do you think is better tracy do you, or do you think jeff is better i don't know just by looking at it right here i'm gonna go with i would prefer to use jeff although tracy's great same release the thing that clamps really hurts the tracy no clamps that really hurts this card and the fact that i can put deep threes on jeff if i wanted it helps out a lot the best thing tracy's got over jeff is the height i would say okay so that is going to be the end of the video, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, make sure to hit the like and subscribe, man, okay? I got more content like this, more gameplay, snipe, sniping videos, all kinds of videos, man, of 2K in general just for the rest of the year. So I hope you guys do enjoy them. And, um, yeah, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.